find the sum in each of the following. Here we have questions where we have to find sum. That is, we have to add them all. So first we'll write point, then 007, because it makes least chances for error. Third is 30.08. Fill other places with zero in order to ease the calculation. So now let's add them. 7, 8, 5, 8, 3. That gives you 38.587. B part. 15.00 and here we write 13.800. Filling other parts with zero. Therefore, we have two, three, fourteen, one carry, five, six, seven, eight, nine, two. Therefore, twenty nine point four three two. C part twenty seven point zero seven six. 0.55 point zero zero four six plus four gives you ten therefore zero eight plus five gives you thirteen six point seven two Therefore, 27.630. D part. 25.65. 9.005. Just place the decimal below decimal. And rest of the digits will follow. You may wish to place other parts with zero or you may not to. That will come through practice. So, 10 plus 5, 15, 18, 3. E part, 0 0.75, 10.425, Now let's add them. 5, 7, 11, 3, and 1, 13.175. F part, 280.69, 25.20, 38, it's a whole number, not a fractional part. So 9, here we write 9, 8, 13, 14, and so it gives 343.89. So that makes your question number first. Rashid spent rupees 35.75 for maths book and rupees 32.60 for science book. Find the total amount spent by Rashid. So let's first write the statement. Spent for maths is 35.75. Similarly for science, 32.60. Now we'll have to find total. Total means addition. So we'll add both the sum. Therefore 5, 13, 8, 6. Therefore, he spent total 68.35 rupees. Radhika mother gave rupees 10.50 and her father gave her 
rupees 15.80 find total so by mother and father we'll write both of them and now we are going to add them because we are asked to find total amount given to her by her parents now simply adding them 0 13 8 plus 5 is 13 1 carry 6 2 therefore total 26.30 now Shreen bought 3 meter 20 centimeter cloth for her shirt and for trouser 2 meter 5 centimeter find total length of cloth bought by her so writing the statements shirt and for trouser and we are asked the total length so we'll add them so first of all let's make a change in terms of similar units so 3.20 meter we have learned it in previous exercises 3.05 meters just dividing the decimal part with or the centimeter part with hundreds because it is a conversion factor because so now total cloth would be 5.25 so it would be 5.25 meters so that makes your question number four Or you can also write 5 meters and 25 centimeters. Naresh walked 2 km 35 meters in morning and in evening 1 km 7 meter. Total walk. Therefore, morning distance is 2 plus 35 over 1000 km because 1000 meter is 1 km. Therefore, we have to convert 35 meters into kilometers. So it gives you 2.035 km. Similarly, evening distance would be 1.007 kilometers. Now we'll have we have converted it into kilometer. Now we can add. You can only add similar units. You cannot add kilometers with meters. You have to make them in either ways. So total distance he walked in a day is 2.035 kilometers plus 1.00 seven kilometers that would give you seven plus five gives you twelve one carry four zero point three so it gives you three point zero four two kilometers so Narish walked total of now sixth question Sunita walked fifteen kilometer two sixty eight meter by bus by car seven kilometer seven meter and five hundred meter or point Now we are asked to find total distance from her school to her residence. We have converted into kilometers. So now we'll add them up. Because we are asked to find how far. So let's add it up. 8 plus 7 gives you 15. 1 carry 7. Again 7. 7 plus 7. 5 gives you 12 and 2 that is 22.275 kilometers total distance question 7 Ravi purchased 5 kg 400 gram rice 2 kg 20 gram sugar 10 kg 850 gram flour find the total weight he purchased so writing all the statements and converting them to kgs how he converted it it is 5 kg that is 5 plus 400 over 1000 because 1000 grams equals or makes 1 kg so likewise we'll do for sugar and flour as well now simply total means addition now we'll add all the weights that we have changed or transformed into kilograms therefore total weight would be equal to adding them all 5.400 sorry it's not 400 it is 5.400 kg 2.020 and 10.850 therefore what we get is 
zero seven two point eight one. Therefore, total eighteen point two seven zero kg. That makes seven.